All right. So the next um, locking blade I have is the Benchmade 300s. This is the Benchmade 300, Benchmade 301, limited edition. So what we have here is a three inch blade, um, G10 handle scales. This one comes either in blue or coyote brown, uh, which you can find pretty much anywhere. But this one is uh, black and green, which a little bit harder to find. I'll explain that later. So the features of this knife is, like I said, G10 handle scales. Uh, this is a three inch blade. This is the first flipper they, they made. So here's your flipper or your thumb stud. I like the thumb stud. Um, and then the flipper comes a nice finger guard with jimping. Uh, this is drilled out in the center, you can see there, to reduce some weight, which I believe the weight is four and a half ounces, roughly. And you have a nice axis lock here, and I think I always said finger choils. Um, this one is made out of 154 CM steel, which in, yeah. Basically... This one has a little bit softer steel than this one because this one is D2 tooling steel. You can see here it's 88 out of 350, so I guess that means only 350 of them were made. Supposedly the D2 steel is supposed to be a little bit harder, retain an edge better, but it's a little bit more brittle. Um, I haven't had to sharpen this one, but this one was fairly easy to sharpen and got a razor's edge. Uh, okay, so basically... That is your Benchmade 300s. Both are manual openings. Um, a little bit more rugged than the Nakamura that I um, did a video on earlier. And all around, I like these knives. Um, but both three inch blades and um, nice and rugged, uh, hefty little pocket knife though, which is kind of my preference. Anyways, if you like these videos, please like, or if you want, subscribe, and uh, feel free to leave a comment.